Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're all doing well and welcome back to Age of Empires 4. Today we're going to be playing the Byzantines in a big old sweaty FFA game and having some fun. So I know the meta is probably to scout with your king, but a little bit too paranoid. Like, what if I roll up on an English base and he gets popped? Although there are no English in the game, so probably, you know what, let's not be a potato. Let's do some scouting. All right, so he's going to use his sprint ability and go scouting. We are playing the Byzantines and we have a very, very strong lobby of players, which I'm very excited about. We even have one Xbox chat, so we have somebody playing on Xbox with a controller here, which is uh, certainly pretty rare. All right, so the king is scouting. Let's try not to run under any TCs, and he does immediately find some water. Okay, let's see how serious of a water situation... Oh, okay, that's actually a legit water situation. All right, then, so that's going to be changing our build order. We're probably going to be going on to one TC now, and uh, I was going to go two TC, but I think now we can go ahead and switch on to the um, just one TC, fast castle... I'm going to try something a little bit different this game. What I'm going to be doing is uh, massing out cataphracts. So I'm going to be getting a bunch of cataphracts and hopefully having some fun. Let's switch you guys onto wood and uh, keep looking around. All right, so who's this? This is uh, Alexios. All right, he's, he's, he's ready. Get a house set up. So let's do that here. Should be fine. I'm a little bit rusty. been playing a lot of Dune. <laughs> but excited to get back to some age as well. All right, so I think he's done enough. I'm going to go. It's making me nervous. I'm going to go put him back in the base now. And the house should finish in time. We shouldn't have any penalties. And we definitely need to take advantage of that water. If we don't, it's just straight up foolish, right? So we got Wang on the Chinese, Abu and uh, Fickle here on the Ayubids, Nanu on the Byzantines, Endeavor on Jushi, myself on Byzantines, Viper on Jean d'Arc, and HRE is going to be Dear Grandpa. So um, yeah, Grandpa's here, dude. He's pissed. And he's going to take out the fury of the boomers on us. Yeah, all right. So jump there. And let's go ahead and send one of you over here to go set up our docks. And if there's nobody up in this corner, that's certainly going to be a nice spot. We need to probably drop off this food, though. Turn game sound up a little bit. There you go. Uh, <laughs> where is everybody? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to give him that information for free. He's going to have to... Um, where from? Or... Yeah, I'm not sure what he's asking. My haggard speed typing there. I don't know if he's asking where we're from. If, he, if that's the case, then... Um, then I'll be happy to answer, but I'm not going to tell him where I am on the map. All right, so over here we got some deep sea fish, which is good, or deep lake fish, I should say, because that's certainly more along the lines of what it is. We can start putting some characters on gold, and the dock will be um, shortly. So we need to deny bounty. There's no roost in the game. So China is probably one of the best in this game mode. They're really good at just going 2TC, fast castle, whatever, and just steamrolling you with palace guard and overwhelming your base. So we need to be more proactive, right? And the old FFA meta was just to sit back and be a mouth breather and just kind of like gather stone and build a wonder. But it's very different now because you need to get king kills in order to rise. All right, so we see the fickle chicken. Ayubids are definitely someone that is um, not the strongest. They do have some decent power spikes in the early, like kind of, you know, I would say castle. They're not bad in castle. You can get relics pretty quickly, do some shenanigans with some of the techs they have. But overall, uh, not the best. You can see how rusty I am. Yes, of course, I was waiting to build this. It was completely intentional, but that's actually going to be good. That'll be hitting more or less everything. All right, so Cistern's going to be popped off here. And um, let's go ahead and get more boats coming. Yeah, all right. The dreaded rust. It has, uh, it has emerged its ugly head. Get the house there. And do we need to have more here? Probably not. The two on gold is going to be adequate for now. And let's go back here. So now everybody's going to be getting that sweet 10%. So we know where green is. Um, we're probably going to have some mortal wombat at some point. I'm tempted to wall him in the north so he doesn't like try and send some camels down to troll me or something. I don't know if that's a good idea, but maybe we will. Okay, so age up. We're going to be going for cataphracts this game. So normally I'm more of an olive oil enjoyer, but I want to try a cataphract build where I just get like a ton of cataphracts in early castle and try and overwhelm the player. Yeah, we'll see how it all uh, pans out. So as far as this goes, yeah, we're almost ready to age up, I suppose. Yeah, kind of getting there. We don't see anybody down there. Anybody who's aging up like around now, it means they don't have water. So um, that's really good for us. All right, so we see Wang down here. So Wang could just, I mean, China's really good. He could just come up here and give me the biz, especially since I'm doing like an off meta build. Could be a little bit dodgy. Okay, we just need a tiny bit more food. I do have the advantage of, of water, though, so I'm hoping... I mean, but odds are he probably has water down there, too, right? So let's do the Imperial Hippodrome, and we can do it like so. All right, so let's do that. We can go raid him a little bit if we want to. I don't think so. I don't think we want to do that, though. We need to just keep getting the uh, fishing. All right, and just kind of go FC. That's yeah, got to be clean. All right, get a forestry upgrade. Let's go see what's cracking here. Was he on uh, stone? He wasn't, so it doesn't look like it's going to be a 2TC shenanigans. 
Let's do this, and then we can get our second uh, cistern over here. So we want it to be, hmm, could it? We do have another gold node over here. This is not a bad spot right here. That will hit both of those and the stone uh, inevitably when we want to go for that. All right, and then we'll build that up. All right, so second cistern is going to be on the way, and we got four on the age up. I think that's enough. And uh, fishing, yeah, it's it's going well. I, I'm almost thinking we do a second dock here and just get like Scrooge McDuck. We just get nice and greedy. Yeah, China down here is going to be a bit of a problem, I suspect. So we will for sure go Chattafrax. Uh, wow, okay, a lot of water. Okay, so I expect everybody probably has access to some water here. I don't care too much about the relics. Not going to be on my uh, forte here. Wang has gotten Feudal Age, which means he is on water probably for sure. Or he's doing some very strange build, but could be one or the other. All right, so when you guys finish this, you're going to get on gold. Uh, I could set up an early tower here just to be safe. I don't hate that idea. I don't hate it. You never know. People people get weird. People get very very uh, cagey in these games. Gonna have to work some politics here, though, if I want to survive. I think uh, doing a stream of the public queues would be very fun, too. All right, so he must have water. With that slow of an age up, he's got to have water. Unless he was doing some weird, like, double song build or something like that. You know, he's got to have a little something, something. All right, let's get boats for the boat god, boats for the boat throne. Get a little bit here, and we see him there. So let's go scout in the corner. If we can take... Oh, man. Ayubids are definitely the easier target, but China is, like, more of a long-term threat. You know what I'm saying? So it's a bit of a tricky conundrum to be put in here. We're going to go cistern to the first hill, too. And that's going to be connected. So now we have the uh, double cistern. All right. And do we want to get any upgrades here? I don't think so. Uh, just get a blacksmith, probably. And uh, fishing upgrade is pretty intensive, but considering how hard we are going on the fish... He must be, must be doing something down here with fishing, right? That was a really slow age up. Unless he's going like early song or something. Yeah, we'll have to find out. All right, so we're on the trees. The Hippodrome is ready. Uh, as far as upgrades go, we could do Expilatories, but I don't think we need to do that right now. Okay, age up is coming along. We're going to save our resources and just try and get Fast Castle to get ahead of people. We do see the fishing legions. I mean, we got a lot of fishing boats. Okay, he's going greed 2 TC. So this is for sure something we, we try and punish. We're going to be rolling down on him with the, the fury of a thousand Chattafracts. We could also start making some basic horsemen. Uh, since, yeah, you know what? A couple early horsemen wouldn't hurt. Why you kill me, Orange? Um, yeah, I'm, I'll let them I'll let them handle those those politics here. Oh, hello. We don't want to run in there and get killed. Impossible. All right, so almost ready. Let's actually cut the horseman. Yeah, screw it. We're just going to do a fast age up. Okay, so the haggard politics have already started. And um, now we can get a couple of you guys do this. And set up the cistern to the first hill, which we can do over here. So I'm going to try something a little bit different, which is going to be fun. All right, where do we want to build that? Like right there? Yeah, that's a nice spot. All right, so they're going to set that up. And then we can get the scary cataphracts. We need to make sure our food is good. And gold is uh, flowing like the salmon of Capistrano. We'll do this as well. Okay, let's keep finding out where players are. In the meantime, I think getting a wall up in the north would be a good idea. So let's start on a little wall. Just so if he does like decide to come at me, then you know I'm, I'm going to be prepared for it, right? Let's cut you guys off. Switch you onto this. I think we have enough uh, food via our fishing boats. And Cistern of the First Hill is up. Nope, going to lose this guy for sure. And we have the Endeavor who is Jushi's. <laughs> I didn't request a surveyor, he says. Yeah, that's pretty funny. All right, so chat of fracking time. Grandpa says he's weak. We got to take advantage of the water we have. You know, you got to work with whatever resources you can get. Let's get into the house here. All right. Then we get the ranged armor upgrades and we, we try some big diving. This will help too, the upgrades on the uh, mining camp. All right, so yeah, castle age soon. Our lumber could be better. Let's go ahead and just kind of pound out a couple of eco upgrades now. We can get you guys on the olive oil. Uh, fishing gives you the goodies as well. So we need to go ahead and get our uh, mercenaries. Wasn't really, you know, too worried about rushing out mercs, but... Yeah, we, we want to get some. Okay, so chat of fracting time. They will conclude pretty quickly. We probably also get like two on stone, I'm thinking, up here. And that should be nice. All right, so the walls of doom are being made, so we should be safe. He says we chill, though. All right, so it looks like they're, they're still pals in the lobby. There's still hope for this world. If those two can be friends, and uh, you know, there's always hope. Yeah, I don't feel like it's the cleanest build here, the timing of it. Go here, and then just get the wheelbarrow too. So we're gonna get most of the core upgrades. Chatterfracks are gonna come out in numbers. The cistern to the first hill, we need to connect it to, um, yeah, whatever, just connect it over here. All righty, and then we need to get the mercs going too, because obviously we want to take advantage of our free olive oil that we're getting. 
You kind of still uh, foolish if we don't, right? All right, so that's gonna be a level three cistern network. We got two on stone to ensure that we can get there eventually. Let's get more eco upgrades. And now we don't have the turn in yet. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot. I think we have enough fishing boats. That's that's gonna be a very good food economy. All right, so one Chatterfract is out. He has four ranged armor, but we want to get a little bit better. Let's do this, and we can get the mercs now. Get that spamming. Give it to me, precious. So we can go there, and then we need to get another cistern up. So let's do this. We can do it right here. And uh, we probably get the Keshiks and just do like a big cavalry-based army is what I'm thinking. All right, so yeah, not really playing relics too much. Could be a mistake, but I think we can get them. I think conquest and having a higher supply cap is probably more important than relics. Not that they're mutually exclusive or anything, but you know, I just feel like that's uh, that's going to be the play. All right, so let's set you up here. We can do this right up here just to get the research speed. All right, very nice. So once he finishes this, uh, we want to make sure we don't get king sniped. But we're going to need a little bit more of that. Houses are coming together. We have the cataphracts, and let's do the yeah, the gulam. And the Keshek. I think I want to do the Keshek one. So I can try and spam those bad boys out. Alright. Yeah, just getting a big Cav army. Um, you know, mercenaries that benefit from our overall strategy. Yeah, that's got to be the way. Get the house upgrade here. Then we get the ranged armor upgrade. And then we go and start doing some heavy raiding. Heavy duty raiding. Alright, let's wall that. And continue our walls. This is weird. Normally in these games the relics are gone. But maybe the meta has like shifted a little bit, right? And that people aren't as greedy for those. Uh, yeah, we can just get on berry bushes here. You guys treat yourself. Let's get that. And the what do the teardrop shields do for the cataphracts? I always forget. Yeah, increases their armor by one. That's super good, right? So they're going to have just a ton of armor. And we're going to go try and champ, trample over China and see how that goes. All right, let's get the mercenaries. The Keshik's coming out. We'll get another merc mercenary shack here. We can do that to get the old uh, mangonel placement in case we get counterattacked by somebody. And he just got Castle Age. So we're going to have a decent timing in terms of uh, you know pushing him. We do have the healing on these guys. Yeah, it looks like we got some flasks, which is outstanding. Let's keep those going, and it's almost time. I assume he's, like, walled up by now. I would I would wager he probably is. All right, let's get some horsemen and uh, horsemen and horsemen here. All right, so that's going to give us the goodies. We're going to get the ranged armor, and when the first two Keshiks pop out, we can go start raiding. He's going to start spamming spears, so we need to preemptively switch into some archer units. All right, uh, no, we don't want that. Cataphracts and uh, you. All right, so let's go down and start the raiding. Let's see if we can get into his base and cause a little bit of havoc. And for you guys, let's do this and do this. Yeah, I'm trying to be more proactive about my walls now that there's a king in play, you know? Definitely seems important. All right, so yeah, here we go. Let's go have some fun. Teardrop shield should be finishing shortly. Uh, we could get more ranged armor. Hmm. We could wait. Yeah, let's wait for the teardrop shields and just gather a little bit more mass, firstly. Get some horsemen going. Let's build gatehouses. And um, I could probably, yeah, it would be an easier kill to go after the player on the top. This feels like it's uh, it's it's going to work out. All right, so the walls of doom. Gonna take some sweet time here. Uh, we can now start mixing in some gulams because he's uh, he's gonna switch into a lot of anti-cav, right? All right, so here we come. Teardrop shield is about to finish, and then we'll have the other ranged upgrade. So now it's Gotham's reckoning. We get in and we just start like having uh, a field day in his base potentially. All right, let's go set up a tower down here to secure all this. Maybe we can still get our hands on some relics if people are just straight up not going to take them. And let's get into the Chinese base now. And uh, we need to cripple him first before. We're not going to go straight for a king kill, obviously, but yeah, he's being greedy as hell. Yeah, he's on two TC and shit. Yeah. All right, so we're here. I don't know where his king is. It's in neither of these places. Uh, so let's go ahead and trample these guys, and then you guys can get this. So, so it begins. Yes, the great, the greatest battle of our time. Let's go ahead and trample these bills. Oh man, he's gonna lose a lot. And I think our knights can just straight up win this, right? He's somehow just already magically teched into a lot of spears. Uh, let's do this and sister into the first hill. Let's go ahead and heal these guys up with the Jesus juice. You guys getting on this, and you guys getting on this. That's pretty brutal. We're definitely going to do some fat damage now. So he's going to take a lot of losses here. And uh, we need to just camp his units here so they can't come back and just keep hunting these vills. All right, let's get horsemen down here. Let's hunt his vills. Keep chasing. All right, let's go after all these guys. Go after these guys. And, uh, yeah, get who you can. He needs to pay the price for this greed, you know. He needs to pay for it. Okay, so as far as this goes, we have another gold over here. So let's go get another gold. And keep hunting these bills down. All right, keep going. And you guys, he's probably amassing some spears in the base. So, yeah, I don't know where his king is, but we can find out in a second. So let's do this. And we can do the treason. 
Ah, so his king is hiding down here in the Barbican, probably. Okay. Clever girl. Yeah, the Chatterfracks are very jacked. Let's go ahead and pop some passive healing on them. And um, are we still hunting down the villagers? We are. Okay, let's go see if we can find them down here. We can't let him get his eco stabilized again, you know? That just straight up can't happen. Okay, let's do that. And yeah, have you guys get that TC? And Oh, he's trying to build a keep here. Clever. All right, so we can go ahead and trample here. Trample the villagers. Trample them all. Ah, we found his uh, gold repository. Very nice. All right, let's get some houses here. Get a little bit of stone going. And uh, as far as upgrades go, we're going to need more houses. Get you to the middle to grab the relics. We just keep farming here. And we for sure done some nasty, nasty damage. He is, he is hurting bad. Uh, so we get this, and then we come down and maybe try and get his king. Is his king chilling in the Barbican? He is. All right, great. All right, so let's get you guys, do this. And um, we can get horsemen coming out of here. His armies are being farmed as they spawn out, which is exactly what we want. We're going to cut off his, his production, I'm hoping. Oh, he does manage to panic build to keep over there. Well played. All right, I still think we're going to be able to probably stop him here. We'll have to see. But he's he's been, at the very least, uh, heavily crippled, right? So we get this. Yeah, supply block him. Let's get some of these guys going down here. He's probably working something on the bottom of the map. Ah, thief. Fool of a chuck. He got the relic from us. And uh, let's build a gatehouse uh, over here. Yeah, we probably want to build a gatehouse over here. Let's do that. Yes. Okay, is he still doing anything here? I'm not sure. Yeah, farming there uh, with these this Shatterfract army is really good. We didn't even get to use Triumph yet, but we will use Triumph at some point. All right, so that got punished. Uh, I would assume he's like doing some funny business down here. We can now start to set up some farms around here. Okay, so we need to get the olive economy going and consider going Imperial Age here soon. Yeah, the early kills are big. They're very big. Okay, so yeah, he's he's not looking to be in good shape. Let's get the Ghulams to finish that one off. It's going to take them a while, but they'll get it eventually. Let's go down and try and get a king kill here. And we might need to come over here and set up some uh, infrastructure uh, siege workshops. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay, I got a big-ass army. I, I, I definitely can get through here. All right, so here he comes. He says, we're chill, though. I've forgiven you. That's funny. All right, so here he is. Yep, yeah, sent down the villagers. Can't let him feast. And uh, he's obviously hiding his king in there. So we just get a surround on that. Use triumph, and then it's a kill. Our knights have, like, crazy good armor. We need to get our horsemen upgraded as well. Requesting help. Who? How? I thought the Wang would be too big and strong to ever ask for help. Oh, my goodness. All right, so that Chatterfract's hunting these guys. And let's get us around on this. Start, start in the Barbican. Yeah, here we go. Uh, we can do Triumph to heal our guys. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit of damage. He's probably just going to bounce over into the keep, though, I would wager. How are the Ghulams doing? Yeah, they're still working on the TC here. Is he gonna try and jump the king out? He might. I gotta be like watching like a hawk here. Okay, let's kill the bills. Keep on this. And do we get damage upgrades? Uh, yeah, now we do. He's gonna try and dart for the keep. Here he goes, here he goes. Okay, are we gonna get the king? He's panicking. Uh, I think we do get the king here. Oh, no, we, we don't quite get him. Okay, he's able to escape here and then you guys do this and then you guys take this down. Very cagey play. I like it, respect it, but that king is eventually going to be ours. Okay, the horsemen are now upgraded, which is good. I am slowing down my tech a little bit here, but I think it's worth. He's completely, basically, just dead, right? So it's just going to be a matter of time. All right, so that's being repaired. It's going to get torched down. The keep is doing a good job trolling us, though. All right, let's get these vills, do this. You guys come over here, and we need to just go uh, whichever way he's going to make a run. Let's see if the flasks heal everybody up. So the big gulp is on the way. Let's get the upgrades. So we need to do the research one here. Yeah, so the research is faster dialectus. Should have done that a little bit sooner. Eh, I don't care. You can have that relic. I just want my prize here. All right, so you guys. Let's get these. And uh, you guys can just go jump on the gold here. Am I being attacked elsewhere? I am. Okay. That is not good. All right, so let's get you guys. Uh, and do this. And just set up a little uh, key back here if possible. Okay, do a little bit of that. I really want to get this king kill, like, really, really bad. Okay, he's got a couple dudes trying to repair here, so we need to pick those off. Um, I am getting attacked here by Jean d'Arc. So we need to move the king back in and do some of this. How are the boats looking? Ah, it's unfortunate timing. I'm being attacked on several fronts. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get the kill on old Wang. I don't think so. It's a, it's a shame. So we just go, we just go bring these guys back to the base, and uh, we need to move our king over here. 
Alright, so the king, he can go here, get these villagers back there, and uh, Wang, Wang will be, he'll be ready for us later, you know. There will be a time when we can, we can go and hopefully, hopefully fight him off. Oh man, king. Oh, they didn't finish this. Okay, they did not finish that. Yeah, I'm losing my navy too. Ah, the timing is very unfortunate here. I was very close to getting a kill. And I did choose, you know, a bit of a harder kill, right? Um, let's get the king in here, and then you guys can do this. Which is going to give us a lot of spearmen, which is what we need to fight these mass cavalry-based armies. I'm pretty sure we're okay here, though. I think we, we hold our own. Uh, we need to get you to the next level here. So let's set up the cistern and do this. Uh, all right. So, yeah, what does this army look like? Veteran Royal Knights? I think we just get Imp now. Yeah. Is someone backstabbing Turin? <laughs> You wish, dude. You wish. All right. Let's get these guys back down here. Jump out. Go fight. He doesn't... I don't know if he knows who I am. Uh, no. Yeah. Abu. Abu. Apparently doesn't know. All right. So let's get some of these guys coming out. I believe they're within the influence. Some of them are. Yeah, not all, unfortunately. Okay. So let's target these down. It's very annoying. Uh, let's get some houses. So they're going, and can we fight them? That is a pretty big army, so let's pull back to the, the defenses of the keep. And you guys need to come up here and set up a little bit of this too. Yeah, help with these houses, bloody. Yeah, we gotta get back to the keep. This is not a, a tenable fight. Not at all. Okay, now the keep is shooting, so maybe we're okay here. And now we can fight in the choke point, and we have the Manganel emplacement and stuff. We got, we got plenty of good static defenses here, so. Yeah, we just need to hold. We've got spearmen coming. We'll continue on the chatterfracks. Let's do the big gulps on our boys. Let them heal up a little bit. Um, we need to go here, and yeah, this backstab was pretty evil. Pretty evil. It's going to be a hard hold, but I think we, I think we'll find a way to hold. I think we will. Okay, so the spears are coming. Should be coming in decent numbers. He does have the rams back here, so let's get these bills to come and try and torch down the rams if possible. Ay ay ay. Yeah, we need those spears to just keep grinding through if possible. Jean d'Arc is in some trouble. Okay, looks like she's fallen. I'm gonna have to figure this out, man. This is uh, this is tough. Cause our food got hit really hard too, so we need to like just fully restabilize. Wang is is brought to you know death's bed basically. All right, let's do a charge here. Chatterfrax, run over the archers and massacre as many as we can. Okay, and then you guys come back onto the olive bushes. And uh, King, we need to get you in the keep here. Chatterfrax may be able to find a way, but like we're off gold right now. There's a lot of stuff that's not going super hot. All right, let's get the sacred sites. Yeah, Chatterfrax, let's use the healing on them, the big gulp. So that's going to heal a couple of those bad boys. And uh, we do have some tramples on the table. Great. In the meantime, where do we go for gold? Um, we might need to go down towards Wangland. Uh, I think we need to get some heavy stone gathering. So let's go get the stone from our base and uh, go like triple TC to have any chances of getting back in this game. So he must have killed, uh, must have killed Manu, actually. Yeah, he must have. Alright, so we're gonna lance him down again. We get a lot of archers there, that was very clean. And, um, yeah, we need to get multiple, multiple TCs to have any chance of coming back here. Alright, so we got one sacred site, let's go waddle and get the other one. Every, like, amount of passive resources we can get here is gonna be pretty big. And, uh, let's just get you guys, one, two, three. Whoa. I'm definitely not in a commanding position. I mean, if we had successfully gotten the kill in Wang, then we would be in great shape, but the fact that we failed on that is not good. So we're level five cistern. We have a keep here. Uh, it's, it's looking a little raggedy. Let's get you to repair it. And uh, Wang is probably rebuilding now. I, I want to keep him down though, if possible. That's two sacred sites. We have middle trade as well, but like in this mode, if you're not getting kills, you're you're just being a potato, right? All right, so let's get that. You guys build this and this. So that's gonna be one, and then we can buy a little bit of stone as well. So let's buy stone and get another TC going here. Uh, how do we want to do this? We can just do it back here. Yeah. And uh, let's rewall. Yeah, losing my whole fishing fleet was rough too. That was like a very, very pronounced attack. We can go ahead and start getting some boats going again. So for Wang, we want to pop out and see what he's up to. So let's get you out of the keep here. Oh, he's in the corner. What the hell? Oh my god, what the hell is this? What is he doing? Oh, wow. We're going to go over there and get that guy. The Chatterfracks are going to hunt down that king for sure. I can't really afford to do much more military here. Um, probably something that would be prudent would be to get a stone wall in the north. 
to keep keep it from you know me from getting oh hello 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 oh my god oh my god oh my god <laughs> look look the king is running to me dude i'm i'm so gonna take that oh man and then i go get wang's king all right this is like my pittance for earlier this is for us getting denied the other king <laughs> i'll take it oh my god let's trample him dude all right whatever i'll take the scraps i'm desperate at this point <laughs> uh, oh my god okay so now we're like straight up in this game uh we weren't out of it by any stretch but yeah that's pretty big that's pretty big for us let's get this and um we can start this and do that and now we go down and try and get wang's king here i know where he's hiding it or at least where it was last seen okay so we got bills let's do this and start getting on gold our gold income kind of low-key sucks let's get all you guys down here and do this whenever someone attacks me I oh wow okay well he's got his own schemes huh all right let's get some chair c phones over here uh, let's go get this and um yeah we're learning about the the nuances of this game mode the salt you know <laughs> oh my god all right so wang's trying to build the great wall here uh, we're gonna have chair phones coming so now we need to pile down and get those goodies if we can uh, these guys are gonna jump out of the gatehouse here we need to get fully stone walled so the wang let's see if he's walled over here because we can't take take our eyes off the prize in the corner you know what i'm saying okay so we're gonna want to get some more uh, military here so let's get some archery ranges two three four okay looking good and then we can get some stables around this one should be adequate military tech let's just get horsemen down here um the breach has been sealed but more stone and having multiple keeps here would be good let's get a mango emplacement all right and let's pop homeboy out all right so he's in the corner here okay so we're gonna send the cavalry to the corner and then we're just gonna get into the base here and try and do some hammering i assume he's got some layers of walls uh sacred site was taken by the camel overlord okay so let's ride by i doubt he's got much of an army but i do know where his guy is uh all right let's see that and the blacksmith was destroyed i need to get imperial though man it's a it's a slow party i know he's back there uh it's just a matter of time so we need to oh he's got a wall up son of a gun i was hoping he wouldn't oh he's got the great wall gatehouse all right so we need to just finish off the wang like because if he's able to rebuild china's insane uh we need to keep that in check all right so 26 on gold probably a little bit excessive but whatever it's fine we'll uh update the lumber economy and update the lumber okay he's got like uh what appears to be some uh palace guard are they elite i don't think so so the chatterfracks are going to smoke them we'll keep working towards that corner do i want to go like wall down here i'm thinking i have some ideas okay so let's come down here set up a tower and uh just focus everything let's get chatterfracks red's attacking me too i mean that's 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 makes me want to attack even more because i need to get my uh i need to get my clutches Please don't kill me. Okay, so let's get up here, take down his landmarks. And uh, let's do Triumph here for a little bit of healing on our cavalry and damage and damage. Our food economy sucks, but soon we're going to get a lot of lumber, and hopefully um, we'll get some of this too. So Wang is losing landmarks, but we got to get that king. He's ours, dude. You know, we need to we need to make sure he doesn't escape down here too, because I suspect that's where he's going to try and escape. Do this, and uh, then we can set up a tower here. Uh, you guys just get on the villages to try and supply block him, and he might make a run for it here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, so I need to get in here, stat. Oh boy, get in, get in, get in. We need to get that king. Oh, it's a race. All right. Get in the way. Chatterfrax, let's go. All right, where's that king at? Oh, they just got to keep up here. Shit. All right, so Wang is there. He's going to repair the hell out of that. Unfortunately, we're probably not going to get it at this point. Um, but yeah. Hmm. Yeah, we're not going to get that king. He's waddling his villagers out this way too. Let's just attack through all this. Yeah, Red's probably going to get it. That's a shame. We just basically opened the way for Red, you know. It is what it is. All right, so how are we doing here? We need to get more farms. So let's go ahead and do more farms for the farm god. Farms for the farm throne. Great. Let's go down here and clear out some buildings where we can. Let's get you in there. Garrison you up. And come back in and just start torching buildings. So let's come down here, get this landmark. 
Got to finish off the Wang. It's very dangerous. Green is certainly someone that um, is potentially a little bit vulnerable too. So we're going to set up towers. The Great Wall in the north has been fixed. So now we need to get like a little something in our main our main gateway here. So let's do that. Um, get a couple of you guys to come build that. Sacred sites are being contested. It looks like Red is over there with the Holy Roman Troopers. It's, it's the dreaded dear grandpa. Um, I don't think the gentleman who donated Endeavor... He was a public player. He wasn't from our Discord, so... I don't believe he donated that king to me on purpose. Which is very fortuitous, but I, I suppose that's the nature of this game mode. Uh, alright. Uh, not yet. Alright, so where's his king at? So, his king, he's he may have his king still. We need to go down here and check. Okay, we're gonna go check here. Let's do that and do a little bit of treason. I think it's down here in the corner. I know where his king is. So we're gonna go see if we can get our clutches on it. All right. So that's going good. Red is there with an Imperial army. Ay, yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna get that. Oh, hell no. Hell no, I don't want any piece of that. Dear God in heaven. All right, let's get you to middle. It's all yours, Red. I'm sorry, it was just a prank, Grandpa. Uh, let's get some Ghuloms. It's Ghulam in time. And uh, our base is just absolutely hideous, but it is what it is. Okay, so I need to get food gathered now. Um, in the meantime, let's get some more fishing out there. Let's get some fishing upgrades. Uh, you guys build another dock here, and then you can help with the walls. Yeah, red red might come for me, which I need to get imp like very quickly here. You can set up another keep, but like he's got like 15 bombard cannons, so it's not even gonna matter. Um, obviously, a shit ton of men at arms and hand cannoneers. Ah, oh, shit, dude, this is bad. If he gets up here, like, we're just so dead. We're so dead. All right. So we would have to, like, scurry to the north and, like, hide our king somewhere, like, around there, right? Okay, we're going to try this. Red might just come and get me. Grandpa might just be able to end me here. In which case, we go hide our king up in the corner or, or take him out to sea, maybe, and try and sail to somewhere else to survive. Well, he probably just die to a landmark snipe. Although we could build a landmark in the middle. Oh yeah, maybe we do do that. So we have like a place to flee. Oh boy. Let's hope he's not coming my way, man. I think Grandpa's gonna like go back and assess his strength first. Before he attacks, I'm hoping. Uh, Horseman can go do some scouting. Oh no, he's here. Okay. So it's it's go time. Yeah, we're gonna need a shitload of units and units and units. Even though I'm down in age. We gotta try and just fight back here. We gotta macro hard. And build our Imperial Landmark later, because we don't have too many choices. Oh man, he's fully... I don't think anybody messed with this man. I think he just got to cackle all day. Okay, so let's do this. Uh, set up a keep back here. Why not? We can move our king there. We're going to go flank his cannons. So Grandpa's gathering in his masses, in his uh, bathrobes. And now we just need to wait for those to be vulnerable, and we just try and, try and get them. Holy shit. Holy shit. All right. One, two, so we get you, you, and a couple of you guys get on this as well. Oh my god, my king is in there still. That's right. Alright. We got the moves. Run to the middle. Alright, so we did get on some of the cannons, which is great. Um, we're holding okay. All things considered. It's not not the worst. The crossbows, though, are fighting a hard fight. You know, they're fighting a really difficult fight. You need to get horsemen here. And um, Grandpa is just going bananas, dude. He's got, he's like too upgraded. Yeah, he's way, way too upgraded. All right, let's get to middle. Set up a keep there. And that's going to be uh, the home of my king from here on out. That's going to be the new, the new throne. All right. So he's got a lot of those cannons, man. We need to get those cannons up. Uh, let's go here. And then we can dive here, here, and here, and here. See if we can get those down. And uh, my king is scurrying to the middle. So this could be a quick one. Grandpa could come in and steal Cheris pretty good. All right, so let's do that. You guys go to the middle. Uh, I need to get an Imperial Landmark potentially going quickly. All right, so let's get on the cannons. One, two, three, and four. If we can kill a couple cannons, maybe we can survive. Do Triumph as well. And you guys pop out and go after the cannons here. So let's do this, this, and this. All right, so the king is almost to the middle. Where's my king? Oh man, did I lose track of him? Okay, he's coming somewhere. We do get that keep down that might buy us a little bit of time. Do we get any of the cannons? We do not. All right, so we need to get those guys. And um, you get onto the farms here. 
How are those guys doing? They're almost down. Grandpa probably doesn't have the best supply lines, so if I can, like, wear him down through, like, sheer attrition. Oh, uh, that's gonna be nice. All right. Do we need gold anymore? I think we honestly need food. All right, let's get here. Do this. And Grandpa, he's I think he's hunting my king down, which isn't a bad idea. All right, we have 11 horsemen here. Is it gonna be enough? It's something. We need to get as many horsemen as we can here and just prepare to dive the cannons. That's what needs to happen here. Uh, town center's in danger. Let's move these guys up this way. We have our center uh, alcove. So I think we need to buy up to Imperial Age now and just do like a landmark in the middle. Let's get on berry bushes here. All right, so you guys in the meantime, let's do this and set up the uh, Fort Engineering School here. Yeah, he's going landmark hunting. So I could, I could definitely get knocked out here. We need to lull him into a sense of confidence where he will not, hopefully, um, yeah, just go straight to my king in the middle. Okay, foreign engineering school is popping off. We got the berry bushes going here. All right, we're still in it. We took too long to kill Wang, and then we got backstabbed. He was just able to get so far ahead of us. Okay, red, pretty, scary, evil grandpa. All right, so we're heading off the reinforcements here, which is good. That's what we need to be doing. Uh, the Palpatine school in the middle, we can hopefully make some goodies. Uh, do I have any way to get research here? We're gonna have to scrap like tooth and nail for this. I think somebody might be attacking him, I'm not sure. Okay, so we gotta just be very cagey here. Um, something is attacking us here, I believe it's cannon. Let's take that down, and we can take that men at arm down there. We do have the Palpatine school in the middle, so we were able to get Impage. So let's get the Horseman Elite at least. And, um, yeah, maybe we can rat our way out of this. Oh, man, I didn't mean to build archers. That sucks. Oh, well, it happens. Um, I think Evil Grandpa is going to be rolling towards mid now. I'm not sure. Can we get to his cannons? Let's go see if we can. Yeah, his army's over there, so let's go pick off some cannons. Um, and now, in the meantime, I think you need to make a run for it, buddy. So let's go here, 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 and uh, try and waddle. Okay, we've kept him busy. Let's just get a million elite horsemen. Um, and we could go out to sea. Let's do a transport ship to be safe. Uh, you guys, in the meantime, can repair some of the fallen landmarks. Yeah, he's coming out here. He wants it. But we can't make it easy for him. Okay, so the king is, is mad dashing it up here. He's our sprinter king. He's keeping his army together. Um, is there any way I can, like, fight this feasibly? Shh, doesn't feel like it. All right, let's get some elite mercs. Yeah, because that'll give us some strelty at least. Okay, so the king is almost there. Let's get him to the transport ship. Let's do this. And the villagers need to just straight up flee the scene. So we'll head this way and see what we can find. Okay, here we go. There we go. There we go. All right, that's what I'm talking about. Let's get that cold run too while we're at it. And that's going to be one bombard going down. That's going to be another one. And we got our king out at sea. So we'll, we'll keep him in the boat here. Should be reasonably safe. Let's get that one. And then you guys get back, and let's just keep spamming out elite horsemen. All right, so this middle area is looking pretty dodgy. Uh, we'll build some cannons here. I don't know. They could help us at some point. Uh, the king is in the water. Uh, this town center is being rebuilt, and we do have some food economy left, but not much. We need to get, like, a lot. If somebody comes and drowns our, our, our king at sea, that would be pretty, pretty horrific. Uh, all right, let's see if we can sneak back to gold. Because we're going to need it here, right? We're going to need it. Let's get the uh, spear... Melee upgrades for the horsemen. Um, cataphracts we can't really afford. He obviously doesn't know where our king is. And the uh, this building, we can just start spamming out cannons. We'll just kind of keep riding around. We could wall off our breach here. So let's do that to make it so we can't get reinforcements through as easily. And mercs. All right. So how are we doing on olive oil? Not much because we got the cannons queued up. All right. Let's uh, creep around the top, see if we can keep hunting those down. And that TC did not get repaired, unfortunately. It will soon. All right. So we dive his cannons again. And in the middle, we have a place where we can survive. Our king is... He's now a seafaring king. He's the lord of the seven seas. He is the he is the lord of the ocean, lord of the brocean. He is. He, we need to just survive until somebody, you know, eventually maybe picks up on the fact that he's pretty scary. Okay, do that. Attack some of these guys. Yeah, the men at arms are pretty giga chat here. Like we would need like a proper full army to fight this, and I don't see that happening. Okay, so the king is going to be safe-ish. We can keep him at sea. Uh, let's get our villagers up here. 
Thankfully, we have the special landmark. Uh oh, somebody might come for us. Let's see. Okay, we have a, a boat there, so we need to be ready to kind of run back to the middle here. So let's go over the top and try and settle in Wang's corner. You know, that's going to be the play. We have a couple of these guys. Yeah, the keep is shooting down some units. Did we actually seal the breach? Uh, we did not yet. All right, so seal the breach and seal the breach here and get the cannon back to the middle. Yeah, the olive, olive cannon is trying its best. All right, team. You guys build a wall here. We're trying to channel our inner Smeagol right now. We know there's gold down there. A couple of horsemen nearby. Um, and yeah, we just kind of keep massing out horsemen in the corner. It's it's our really our only mechanism for fighting back here. Oh man, that's, that's not good that we've been detected here. We might need to jump the king out. Uh, let's go ahead and get the olive business here. And uh, in the meantime, we can do... Is there any way we could like wall this? Yeah, kind of. Kind of. Go, my horseman. Um, and I don't think anybody's hitting red. Red's going to... I have 300 supply, lads. Maybe 350. They're gonna... I need to just politic the scheme and get back in this somehow. Okay, so we need to also build a dock here so we have another escape mechanism. I feel like we're like the Pirate King. Okay. And then you, in the meantime, build some houses down here, because why the hell not? He's gonna leave. Um, we need to pull you guys back and repair landmarks. Because this is going to be uh, an issue here. He's going to get here soon. So we need to finish this wall. And then you guys can... Uh, I don't have a market. Shit, I can't buy any stone. Okay, perfect. So let's go hunt some cannons. And you guys go build some... Rebuild some landmarks. So let's get the cistern to the first hill. And you guys need to come back up here and do this. So we need to distract him, basically. Two, three, and four. So yeah, he's, he's a good player. He scurries back, but this is exactly what we want. We just want him to be busy and struggle a little bit here. All right, so our king is at sea. We need to be very cognizant of where he is. Okay, let's go hunt these again. Uh, villagers should be back in a moment. They can repair the cistern to the first hill. Uh, we need to actually get a market and then repair it so we can buy. I didn't even realize there were kings. Hell yeah, dude, let's go. All right, finally he slips up on his cannons and we're able to punish him. So that might end the siege. Without his cannons, he can't really knock through a lot of my stuff. Let's do the flasks and get that last cannon down if we can. Can we? Not going to happen. All right. So the haggardness is, is fully assembled here. We've got this rebuilt. Let's go, baby. And hotkey this. Sometimes you just have to channel your inner golem, dude. You know? He's going for the boat, but he's certainly not going to get it easy. Because uh, now we can just land the king here. Let's wait and see where he's going. I think he's going up there. The middle is safe-ish. Can like kind of pursue and harry a little bit. Okay, we don't want that. Let's uh, get you to shoot his cannon if we can. Get our olive cannon to trade there. Red's creeping around. It looks like he's going down here. That has been rebuilt. All right, so we're like okay now, sort of. I mean, okay, we're we're a long ways from okay, but all right. Let's do this. Got that. And um, do a little bit of this. Let's go ahead and seal this breach here. So we can't get back in. Yes. And you guys, let's buy some wood. Do that. And the king is, is, is safe. He's trying to get a landmark kill on me here. How little did he get in, by the way? It's very weird. I don't know how he actually got in there. Shit, son of a gun. All right, so you guys, we need to get you on some lumber or something. We just need, we just need some resources. So the main base is secure. Our king is at sea. Um, and yeah, the base is, is coming along. Slowly but surely, man. Slowly but surely. Uh, do we have any wood alcoves? We do not. But we do have a landmark here, so we're okay. We're not making villagers. I need to just survive. Just scrap super hard. All right, let's get some lumber upgrades. Why the hell not? I managed to keep some eco alive, too. And uh, yeah, this is good. Oh, he's fighting yellow now. Good. I think yellow is attacking him. This is a uh, perfect timing for us, because I think we actually have some capability of coming back in this game. It's not likely, but it's possible. All right, so let's get the walls. We got stone walls all over the front here, and let's get you back to repair this. Uh, hand cannoneers trolling us, so let's get you guys back into the base for now. It's going to be fine, and uh, oh yeah, he's getting hit. The chicken is coming for him. And this is what happened to me too, right? Like, I don't, I don't feel bad for him. I, I got attacked, and then the lobby turned against me a little bit, um, which is good. You know, there's, there's ebbs and flows of strength. 
Okay, I don't want to be like that close, so let's keep our king up here. And uh, now we need to repair some of these landmarks, so let's repair this. And then we need to just spam TCs, basically. A little bit of stone left to gather, so let's do that. And that looks great, so the villagers are hustling back. We're going to lose this landmark eventually, but... Yeah, I think it's okay. Alright team, we're back in it, baby! Never say die. All right, let's get a uh, little tower up here for you. Why are there three of you, he says. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, my friend. We've had that passive gold for a long time. And, um, yeah, we can do this just to seal it for now. The town center is being repaired. Let's buy a little bit of this. Um, what do we need? 350 for that? Okay. Set up another TC here. The Byzantine overlord is going to go back to his original hiding spot. Definitely using docks to um, move your king around. A controller, Chad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wang is in here watching. Yeah. He is. Oh, he says I'm not a controller? Maybe he's not on the controller? I'm not sure. Okay. Interesting. So we do have some fields that can be worked still. Um, that's great. So let's get back to working those. Delete this one. Our base is for sure in shambles. It was once a beautiful, lush empire, but now it's it's fallen into a bit of disrepair. But, you know, we didn't hear no bell whatsoever, so... Let's just mass out, like, a bunch of horsemen, so at least we have something to fight with. And we need to get a uni, too, if possible. All right, let's get a uni up here. Secret and save. So that's going to be two town centers. Um, he can go in here. It can be a stone tower for now. Let's get you guys back down. You can turn in, help with this, and then come down here. And yeah, they're, they're going after the docks here, which is kind of troll. Let's get a drum on. Should be able to deal with those men-at-arms. And um, we got olive oil. And start on a great wall over here. And we, yeah, we have the population supply cap, man. So if we can somehow, you know, weasel our way back in this. Like, I'm feeling like my odds are not great, but they're not, like, off abysmal either, right? Let's do this. Wang has a lot of gold down in his land, so we need to go take that. Um, and now we get our horsemen, and we can even go try... We can get, like, a mass horseman army and try and king snipe. All right, so we need to get that repaired, too. So let's start repairing this. And houses for the house gods. Biology is going to be up on the docket as well. The drum on here is flamethrowing these guys. And um, Green and I are sharing the seven seas right here. He does have a military ship. It was Teal who attacked me before. All right, so that looks good. How are we looking? Yeah. We definitely want to get those Imperial upgrades if we can. Houses are going. So let's just get all those into houses. Red is setting up outside my base, which I don't like. So we're going to go try and take that keep down real quick. He's going to be back for sure. Um, I won't be ready to fight him. That's for damn, that's for damn sure as well. Uh, Why well, can only make 200? Uh, did you kill a king? I don't know if he did. I don't know if he did. Maybe he didn't. Maybe he did. Well, anyways, we're going to take this down. Um, the Hippodrome is on its way to being repaired, so let's get double up on that. Fortunately, I only have the flasks. Let's get a full surround and farm them for gold. Ah! Uh -huh. Yes, farm them for gold. Maybe they're not going to get it up. Let's see if they do. Ah! Uh -huh. Ah! Great. Excellent, excellent. These guys are hustling for gold. Let's go peruse the lands. We can pop out of our little stone tower here and use trees in. He's got his king and a keep back there with the relic, so we're likely not going to get that. Trade is also very much on the table for us, too. We need to start considering some trade. So probably what I'm thinking is go to Wang's old corner. Yeah, and then set up trade going to the middle. Looks like there's a market there in his fallen base. And um, up here, let's do this. All right. Still in it, baby. Still got it. Gold's back online. That feels great. We need to get biology. It's for sure going to be one of the big priorities here. Uh, okay, so Red, it looks like he's coming back. Let's see if we can get into his lands here. I doubt it, but is there any way we could actually hold Red back? Probably not. Um, probably not. So we need to be ready to shuffle our king again, and I'm going to attack his base to try and make him sweat a little bit. And Green is unfortunately killing some of my fishing boats. Yeah, it's a shame. Ah, what can you do, man? What can you do? All right, so we're going into Red's base. We're going to try and get his king here. Do we have the triumph charges? We do not. Uh, I don't know if he's going to come all the way here. I mean, my army is big, but not huge. Although it seems like, yeah, green's, green's had enough of me being on the water. So we're going to need to switch into a land-based economy here, which is fine. All right, so we found his king. Uh, it's down here. Uh, do I have the, uh, the triumph right now? I don't, but soon. We found his king. He's back here. I don't think I have enough horsemen. 
Yeah, my food sucks so bad. I need to get that online. Alright, so we're gonna just try and threaten this to make him sweat a little bit. Ideally, what that does is it pulls him away from my base. Right, and in the meantime, we can go set up food. So let's just do this. Okay. How's it looking here? Let's go see if we can find his farms and stuff. I think that's gonna be good. Yellow's not, uh, red is not making friends with anybody. Uh, all right, let's get rid of all these and fix that. And then we can do a little bit of optimization here. All right, so we're gonna just try and raid his lands basically. You know, we can fight here and then, yeah, he's got a huge military infrastructure. So to fight that army comp, we need to get mercs online, obviously. Okay, and then we need some probably some crossies or and or hand cannoneers. Okay, so he's he's we're keeping him busy. He's distracted. He's making himself a bit of an enemy. Um, green might be somebody that we try and king snipe at some point. We'll see. And now in the Wang lands, we can go ahead and do some cross trade here. Yeah, it's not the prettiest, but it'll have to do, pig. It'll have to do. All right, uh, one. Okay. So let's go ahead and get another TC here. That's great. And we're just kind of exploring, man. He's got a vast, vast war machine, and he's been healthy this entire game. I don't know if anybody's even been targeting him, to be honest. All right, so let's get this. Let's get this. Building health isn't really going to help us. We do see somebody kind of creeping in the sides over here, so let's get this. Uh, like that and like that. Yeah, we need to, like, reseal that so nobody can, like, charge in and just hunt, hunt my old king here. And the mercs, I mean, we have some olive oil saved. Let's get the elite mercenaries. Elephants won't be super good here, but... Yeah, a little bit of trade. It never hurt nobody. Oh, boy. Okay, here we go again. Round 10, fight. It's the fickle chicken. He, his vengeance has come, and it is it is fierce, and it is strong. Uh, is he going to make it in? I mean, he's got mangonels and stuff. Uh, we probably do this and set up a little keep here. I think the chicken's going to get in, unfortunately. Yeah, he's going to get in. I have, like, no military whatsoever, so we need to go ahead and hustle you down to this corner. So he's going to go ahead and sprint right now. Let's use your wheels, buddy. Let's, uh, let's do it. Let's get ghoulams and get you guys back. My food majorly sucks. All I can really do is get mercenaries, and uh, his army is not amazing, though. It seems like he's he's got some elite archers, but aside from that, if we can muster some resistance, maybe we'll be okay. Um, where'd my king go? He's, he's already sprinting down here. Oh, boy. And the keep is going to finish, thankfully. That's that's big. Without that, we would be in serious danger. Uh, all right. Does the king really want to flee? Let's pull him into one of the TCs up here. Uh, he's got the, the uh, firing. Okay, let's get you guys. Let's get some horsemen. Um, wow, that's a bit of mangonel damage, isn't it? All right, let's get back. Do some repairs from the shadows. Ooh, that, that spray fire is pretty good, isn't it? All right, so let's garrison up. And let's go back and try and dive these. Dear God. All right, we might need to make a dive for the corner, actually. Yeah, I think we do. So let's head down here. Grab you guys. Go here and here and try and repair our middle landmark. And we're going to dive his artillery here now. All right, so that's one down, and let's kind of keep getting on him if possible. Let's get you guys to engage in the front. That's going to be two down, maybe? I'm not sure. All right, let's uh, anyways jump here. It's Ghulam in time. And uh, Abu has been eliminated. That's not the guy I'm fighting, is it? No, it's not. Okay. We're trying to fight, man. It ain't easy. It ain't easy. The king is the king is waddling very slowly down to the south. Now we need to go here and here and repair that landmark if possible. Um, his army, like I said, is not top tier, but it's enough. You know, I'm like, I've been on deathbed for a long time. He's getting very mad. Abu is. Um, we just need to find a way to weasel and survive, dudes. That's it. Let's get you guys middle. Go repair this. Uh, we're going to lose a bit now, but it's not the end of the world. The mass horseman army would do good if I had some resources. Took too much bros. What is he talking about? I have no idea. He's just he's just ranting about something. He's unhappy about the nature of uh, of life. Okay, let's get upgrades. You guys just hide in the corner for now. We're trying to rush in here. Let's set up a gatehouse. We've got 17 bills, and the king is on his way to the corner to make a, a new rat's nest. So we're gonna go like move in here. So let's wall Wang's old forbidden base, and then we can build a gatehouse, and our king can move into the corner there. Uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh. Everybody wants a piece of this booty. Everybody wants it. It's like Byz Byzantine historical recreation. All right, so we're waddling to the corner. Uh, we're kind of running out of places to hide, that's for sure. 
Uh, he's just ravaging the base. I'm kind of hoping that when Red gets there, he's gonna he's gonna discover the other rat's nest, you know. All right, so let's get this. Our king has almost made it to the corner, to the Wang corner. Um, let's get our traders and like hide them over here to throw them off where my actual base is. And Red is going to my base to try and kill me. Yeah, he might be able to. He very well could. All right, so let's get uh, buy a little bit of this. But now we need to go to the middle because we need to try and repair that landmark. I think we're just dead because he's going to get this landmark. Um, maybe we can like sneak some bills for like ninja repairs. Maybe. Let's keep one bill here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh huh. Start on this. We keep you in the corner here, buddy. And, oh uh, man. Okay, Red's coming with a pretty big army. We got all these bills here. They can come in and do some ninja repairs. He's not landmark sniping me, which is good. Red is coming in, though, to finish the job. But sneaking, sneaking around the back of Red's army is going to be tough. I don't think anybody else is fighting Grandpa and who's dead. Oh, yeah, I'm toast. Uh, green, we need to fight evil Red. You know, that's the truth of it. Yeah, that last landmark's looking mighty vulnerable. Hippodrome is also there. Red's got, like, full map, dude. Yeah, he's definitely the boss hog right now. Can I can I get in that, like, neutral keep? That's kind of a funny one. Green maybe leaves? No, he's still hunting my bills down, dude. <laughs> Byzantine historical recreation. It's the role play. Uh, he's, he's killed everyone. I am weak. Okay, let's do a little distraction there to try and run him off. Okay, let's see all this. Nice, nice. The forbidden repairs. Now we can... How? Yeah, he's able to squeak through there, isn't he? Yeah, that's a shame. So we move through here and hide. It's pretty funny. Alright, so these villagers can take down this cannon and then go this way. Uh, my last landmark is on the precipice of death. Okay. So we build this. It's so funny. He's like trying to hunt my guys, but... We, we got the tricks. Okay, he's got to keep over there, too. Okay, so where's he going? Let's do this. Have you guys keep waddling down here? Are they targeting my last landmark? Not yet. Those two are fighting, which is buying me a little bit of time. Okay, so those walls are about as good as it's going to get. Uh, let's do that, and then we can wall this. Can we wall this somehow? Yeah, great. And you guys come down and build your own wall over here. Come on. Oh, it's going to be the enemy, dude. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. That was a wild-ass game, dude. Wild wild game. It was kind of, in some ways, maybe going after Wang was a mistake. Because when we hit the Wang, uh, GG, well played. Great stuff. He played very well. When we went after the Wang, um, it Good really game. weakened us. Well played. It really did. So now he's basically just toast. GG, boys. Yeah, Grandpa's going to clean this one up. Because we took away Red's natural predator, but like killing China was, I, 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 I'm like 99% sure I could have gotten a king kill up here, which arguably is more prudent. But Wang is extremely good, and he's playing the, one of the best civs in this format. So I figured we'd have to do that. But this game is basically over at this point, so I won't drag you guys through this. Grandpa's gonna annihilate this man. Uh, he's up in the corner. He's poor. He doesn't have any passive gold. It's, uh, it's gonna be GG well played. So, yeah, that was a fun one. That was like a Byzantine history all over again. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. See you next time. Well played to all these guys. We scrapped and fought as hard as we could, but sadly nobody could stand up to red. Uh, and I was too beat up to do it. You know, I had already been attacked by Teal, like all in. So we paid the price. But that's it. Take care of yourselves. See you next time. And that is it for today.